Daily Hammer Prayer for Destiny Breakthrough Father, I intend to live out the destiny you've written for me in the book before you formed me in the womb. I overcame the Antichrist by the blood of the Lamb and the word of my testimony. So I go boldly to your throne of grace, your mercy seat, where the blood of Jesus Christ was spilled as a ransom for me. I have access to the mercy seat, so I have access to the spilled blood of Jesus. I now make contact with his blood here at the mercy seat and apply the blood to my forehead, my body, my soul, and my spirit, my doors and windows, my life, my family, my destiny, so that death and evil spirits always pass over. Now I pray, whereas a vaccination is a substance that produces immunity against a disease, and the disease of earth is sin, which leads to suffering and death. I hereby receive the life blood of Jesus Christ into my blood, veins, capillaries, arteries, cerebral fluid, body fluids, hormones, body chemistry, and mitochondria, even my DNA going all the way back to conception and through my life to the end of my life in Jesus' name. Father, I thank you for sending your most aggressive, warring and ministering angels to guard the gates of my body, mind, will, and emotions. I pray for your warring and ministering angels to guard the gates of my spirit, my childhood foundation, my ancestry, and my blood. I pray for your warring and ministering angels to guard the gates of my relationships, my youthfulness, my ministry, wealth, house, neighborhood, city, state, and country. Thank you that your warring and ministering angels would specifically guard the gates of my senses, my eyes, ears, nose, mouth, tongue, fingertips, skin, and the gates of my other body systems, including reproductive, endocrine, exocrine, respiratory, circulatory, immune, muscular, nervous system, digestive system, renal urinary, skeletal system, integuminary, and lymphatic. For every available angel of God to guard the gates of my God-ordained destiny, my spiritual gifts, my glory, and biblical revelations. I welcome all warring and ministering angels available to come into my dreams and visions as I sleep, to guard, guide, protect, and defend me, to prevent my harm, to show me the way, to assist me in breakthroughs, to lead me to needed information, to highlight what I need to see, and to heal, restore, and minister comfort to me in my dreams. I call forth every available angel of God now to hunt down and destroy every evil spirit masquerading in my dreams as a creature, a friend, a loved one, a quarter, or a spouse, and to destroy or disconnect me from the strong man or power behind these evil agents. Father, I repent for every sin I have committed in waking life or in my dreams and visions. I hereby consecrate the following to God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit, for as long as I live in Jesus' name. My body, soul, and spirit, my daytime and nighttime, my dreams and visions, my personal prayer altar, my associations, communications, and relationships, my home, property, and neighborhood my city, state, and country, my blood family and marriage family, my children and pets, my marriage bed, my mattress, my words, thoughts, motives, commitments, and actions, my jewelry, my clothing, closet, shoes, hats, undergarments, and swimwear, my car, bike, and other transportation, my devices and online platforms, 
my ministry, company, business, work, or general online presence. All of the food, drink, and medicine that I take in dreams and visions and in waking life. All lotions, perfumes, and other substances. All contracts, agreements, leases, mortgages, and loans. My wealth, financial accounts, employment, paychecks, investments, and enterprises. Father, I ask you for the correcting of any areas of the above that are not aligned with the living God. And I pray for immediate sanctification of all of these things from any evil tie or influence in Jesus' name. I praise you, God. I thank you, Jesus, for your work on the cross where you shed your blood through which I overcame the Antichrist. Thank you, Father, that your angels are poised to respond in action when my biblical prayers are spoken. Thank you, Jehovah, for your power of prayer and giving me hope in you during these latter days. I honor and exalt your greatness and your holy name. I will keep praying and listening for your guidance and will follow what you tell me to do by your Holy Spirit that's in line with the Word of God until I'm living out my destiny for the kingdom of God. Amen.